Hello guys, welcome to Shum TV. Today is we're going to discuss about the turtle. When they start buying a turtle, how do I take care of my turtle? What turtle do I own? And then what tips could I share to my fellow turtle enthusiasts? or turtle lover that who wants to own in the future also lastly what turtle uh, i want to own in the future okay guys enjoy the topic for this vlog okay sorry about that nice there's a motorcycle anyway Enjoy, uh, enjoy this vlog <laughs> and <laughs> hope I could share a lot for the turtle lover. Game! So, question number one What kind of turtle do you own? So, for question number one, I have two kinds of turtles that is Asian box turtle or what they call as a Malayan box turtle. In the Philippines and also a red ear slider that is common in US. Question number two: What is a red ear slider? So red ear slider. Red ear slider is a semi-aquatic turtle that came from the US or mostly popular turtle in the US that they take care or they pet as they put it in the pond or aquarium so let me get a example of a red ear slide so this one wow. is a Unlucky. big or semi-adult red ear slider it's a female so so paano mo na differentiate yung male sa female so female has a flat tummy or a flat belly as you can see then next you can also known as a female a red ear slider if their nails at the front are equal males have very long nails and female doesn't have a long nail so let me show you a male red ear slider here we go so this is an example of a male red ear slide. Look at the nails. It's very long compared to the nails of a female. Another is their belly. As you can see, there's a conky. So that when they meet, like that. That is the force of the conky of the red ear slider. Okay, let's put it back. Next. What is the difference between MBT and Asian box turtle? So, MBT, uh, that is uh, what you call in the Philippines as the Asian box turtle. So, Asian box turtle is a 50-50 turtle. They want to go 50% in a land or in the go in the pond as they swim a little bit. So let me show you an example of an NBD or the the Asian box turtle. So this is an example of an MBT. 
It's a male. As you can see again, it's a okay. Okay. The nails. So MVT doesn't have a very long nails. Like the red ears, like. Okay. <clears throat> this one is male. Next. So how many tails do you own? Well, apparently, I have seven uh, adult turtles and also I have three uh, young turtles. Sorry if I'm a little bit sweaty because it's hot here in the cold. All in all, how many turtles do you have? I have 11 turtles. Seven plus D live. Oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> 10 turtles. My apology. My apology. And when did you start? I mean, kailang ka nagsimula maglaga or mahilig sa mga bagong? Uh, nagsimula siguro maging turtle enthusiast, turtle lover, turtle fanatics. Uh, Noong napanood ko si Kuya Kim sa Matang Lawin. Yun, nakita ko yung mga turtle niya. Yung tortoise niya, yung marmat turtle niya. Uh, also, uh, I watched some videos in YouTube like the Paul Capero. He's a YouTube vlogger. You can see turtles and other animals. Yun. Next. So in the future, what kind of turtle do you want to own? Well, the future, hopefully, I can have some tortoise, the sulcata, the red foot turtle, the cherry head turtle, a ah, tortoise, sorry. My bad. And Rage of Turtle. Also, in the turtles, I would like to have a Western pe uh, painted turtle. Then, what else? The Yellow Spotted Turtle and Indian Spotted Turtle. And Lastly, a pink belly turtle. Next. So, last question. As a turtle enthusiast or turtle lover, what kind of advice or tips can you give to your viewers in taking care of, of your turtles? Well, I could advise that uh, proper proper food uh, proper sunlight proper water cleaning then also uh, treat them as your your family because I mean yung turtle kasi may personality siya na na, na mali siya maka-recognize ng mga ano tawag dito yung pinaka-amo niya so sino pa pa pupunta siya sa iyo lagi pag nakikita kay nakala niya may binigay kang pagkain <laughs> kahit kahit wala ayun nag-aabog siya kala niya titibok siya ano so masaya kasi mag-alaga ng turtle so nakakaano siya yung stress reliever uh, ano pa ba yung masasuggest ko? Siguro proper ano, proper yung tal dito environment sa, kasi ako, hindi ako gumamit ng UVB kasi naka-outdoor ako nasa labas lang ako so, may sunlight talaga so yun yung sunlight important pero kung sa mga indoor kailangan gumamit ng uh, UVB para sa ano nila magandang 
broke ng shell nila. Tapos, yung water naman, yung constant change yung kapag madumi na siya. Kasi, ang maturtle, mabilis talaga siyang dumi ang tubig. Dahil, unang-una, yung pupo niya. Sorry sa mga kumakain. Saka yung wheel nila. Yun, nahalo sa tubig. So, ako kasi, hindi ako masyadong naglagay ng ng soil kasi wala akong masyadong space pa. But in the future, hopefully, I could buy a big turtle tub that could uh, also incorporate the soil so that I could breed them, breed them or have some eggs in the future. Yun. So, ano pa? Uh, yun. Filter. Important yan. So, ang filter kasi sa turbel uh, para malays nyo yung dirt nila sa sa water. Tapos syempre para hindi hindi sila pita ng turtle rat o yung parang fungus ba yun kung tawag na uh, pwedeng makasila sa shell nila kumbaga sa fish fin, fin rat diba yung fin rat is pinakain nila yung mga fins ng ita yan kasi pag masyado nang madumi yung water tapos sa nalilang kundi ko yung pagkain nila so pinapakain ko sa turtle ko ito Baka naman, baka pwede nyo. <laughs> Maging ano, diba? Ito yung pinapakain ko. So, twice a day ko silang pinapakain. Morning and night. Tapos, pagka week ends or minsan, ayun, sorry, may dumana ng motor ko. <laughs> Nasa outdoor kasi tayo. Pag weekends, so, Misan binibigyan ko sila ng vegetable or fruits like lettuce, uh, repolyo, yun. tapos sa fruits, banana, yan, nakain nila. Yan, tapos apple, yan, mango. Yan. Tapos, na pala, another advice, so kung nakanawa sa kayo or tap water, Ah, uh, reminder lang na gamit tayo ng anti-chlorine kasi para hindi siya harmful sa turtle kasi may chlorine ng mga nawasa unless kung poso tayo or deep well yun, pwedeng direct yun para hindi sila magkasakit kasi di ba yung turtle hindi naman sanay sa mga chlorine natural water sila So, I could tell something in, in my turtles uh, I will show you my first turtle This is Where is my first turtle? My first two turtle <laughs> It's too far This is my first two turtle. This is this is let me get a figure. This is Mika and Leo. So I named them uh, in the Ninja Turtles as sorry again as the Ninja Turtles. This is supposed to be a Michelangelo but unfortunately this turtle is a female and this one is a male. So I have them for almost a year now. I bought them last year, March. So, 
Mika has a personality of being a grumpy. She is a, type, a shy type, as you can see. Sorry about that. He, he, uh, she don't want to be pet, unlike, unlike Bia, as you can see. Not a shy type. Next! My next turtle, I bought it a month last year when I bought the Red Air Cider. So, again, uh, I followed the name. And then the turtles. So this is uh, Rafa and MBT. Let's see. It's male MBT. Uh, I I have been for almost a year. And another one is another MBT. Then this year I bought another two ah sorry two adult red deer slider. Wait, two female. Which slider? This is my latest female. It's an adult. So the owner uh, decided to let go. Uh, na lang siya kung baga. So, uh, uh, as a turtle lover. So, I, so this is Michelle. And Another one, another red ear slider, female, uh, where is the other female? It's another slider, she is hiding under the stove, yeah, another one is female, this is Monica. A female, she can see flat or long legs. I think this one is uh, much, uh, almost a half year old, maybe six months. So. Then another is last my last MBT. This one is a male also. It's a small MB. This one is half year old also. Maybe six months, around six months, seven months. And lastly, my tree. Lastly, my three small turtles. The young ones. Guys, nito sila pagka magpa. Tatlo silang ganyan ko. Doon sila sa sa baby pond. So, eto hindi pa ma-distinguish kung male or female. Kasi, they are too young. As you can see, hindi mo pa masyara. Pero I think, oops, nagwiwi. Hehehehe. <laughs>
Maybe we enter tell. Yan. So, if this one is a mayor because of the pumpkin already. This one could be a mayor. Plus sila. Ayaw magpakuha ng dalawa. <laughs> yeah. So, guys. Ayun, medyo gumagabi na. Ayun, niputi na nga eh. So guys, I hope you have my vlog today and sana nag-enjoy kayo sa mga turtles ko at sana may natutunan kayo. So please like, share, and subscribe my channel for again, sorry for that. I hope you like my video for today and see you again on the next video. Bye guys!